Hey everybody, I've got a new DIY for you. We're going to make a tiki torch planner. This is perfect if you don't want to use one of those ones on the poles. These are great for your patio in the summertime for mood lighting and to, and to keep those mosquitoes away. So first off, I bought this bag of River Rock at Walmart for about four bucks. And it's huge and heavy, so be careful. <laughs> I then went to Dollar Tree and bought this cute little hexagon planter that we're going to paint. And then I bought this spray paint by Rust-Oleum. It has a stone textured finish to it. And I already had these little tiki lamps that were used in some old bamboo poles. So I thought I'd repurpose them here, but you can totally get these at Walmart for super cheap too. So first what we're going to do is just prime and paint the planter. It's plastic, so um, I'm just going to use some Waverly white chalk paint that I got at Walmart, but you can totally use um, any kind of primer or spray primer. We just need to give something for the uh, Rust-Oleum stone texture spray paint to grip to. So I want to get rid of this little black stripe at the top. So I'm just going to go in and paint the entire planner with a couple of coats of chalk paint. Uh, the, the top of it where the black stripe is, I'm going to give two coats because I don't want that to show through. But I'm, again, just wanting something for the spray paint to grip to. And I'm going to let it completely dry between the coats. After it dries, let's just take it outside in a very well ventilated area and please make sure you use a mask of some sort because I made the mistake of not using one and I think I hacked up a lung. Be careful and protect yourself. So I did two coats of the spray paint letting it dry between both coats completely. And then next I filled my tiki torch with some mosquito repellent oil. Um, then just took the river rock and put a thin layer at the bottom to give the tiki torch something to sit on and to raise it a bit higher so it clears the planter top. Then just put the rocks all around it and that's pretty much it. It's done. Uh, I took it outside and after having a little trouble with the lighter I finally got it lit and man does it look awesome. It really looks good at night. Um, so I think I'll do another one too. Uh, so I'll have two. But now the outdoors can be so much more pleasant without those nasty blood sucking mosquitoes and it will be like a nice uh, little fire ambiance mood lighting. So I would totally pair this with some wine or iced tea, a good friend, your favorite swing, and you got yourself a nice evening of porch sitting and gossiping and storytelling. <laughs> So I hope you guys enjoy. If you want to see more DIY ideas, visit my website, birdnetstudio.com. Thanks for watching.